we proudly present DePaul University's 122nd Commencement Ceremonies. When I hear the words graduation day, I feel elated, uh, very thankful for everyone on my journey, my parents, my friends, my family. I'm feeling good because being a student is like having a little shelter around you. The expectations are a little bit different and once you graduate, it's like you come out of your cocoon, now you're a real adult, so. <laughs> it is a privilege uh, to be able to be wearing these robes and to have this degree and eventually have a license that will allow me to practice law. When I hear the words graduation day, I think of accomplishments and hard work, sacrifice, and joy. Lots of feelings, but excited. I feel proud of myself, you know, that I was able to make it all the way to the finish line. I feel accomplished, I feel excited, and finally, it's today. The achievement of a dream. That's really what graduation day means to me. If I had to sum up DePaul in one word, it would be transformative. My mindset has completely changed. I've been exposed to perspectives that I wouldn't have otherwise had. <laughs> I don't know, it was amazing. You know, the faculty, the school. I could also describe it as electric, because you, um, you feel the energy whenever you come here. Um, you have your good time, you have your bad time, and uh, but to the end, you do find that everything you've been through is worth it. So that's why I choose the word rewarding. As a dream and now it's reality. DePaul makes dreams reality. Please welcome the Provost of DePaul University, Dr. Salma Ganim. Members of the faculty, staff, administration, honored guests, and of course our graduates, it is my pleasure to welcome you to our 122nd commencement ceremony. Commencement is one of the most meaningful ceremonies of a student's academic career, and a DePaul commencement is anything but ordinary. As a Catholic Vincentian University, we share a commitment to uphold the dignity of every single person. We call it Vincentian personalism. That is why we take the time to recognize every graduating student. As part of today's ceremony, we will feature you on your own digital slide. We want to give every student their moment because that's the DePaul way. It's also why we encourage all the students, family members and friends watching to stay until the end. We know how many challenges the class of 2021 faced this past year. When you joined DePaul, I'm sure this was not the final year or the commencement ceremony you envisioned. If you feel frustrated or sad or disappointed, that's okay. Trust me, I get it. This academic year has been like no other. From learning remotely to social unrest, to witnessing heartbreaking acts of violence and racism, you have overcome tremendous hurdles. As a result, you are now stronger and wiser. While living through a global pandemic has certainly affected your time at DePaul, don't let it define your entire experience. You ran the marathon, and today you crossed the finish line. Let's celebrate your many accomplishments. I do hope you participated in and enjoyed the graduation celebration event we held on the Lincoln Park campus for 10 days in the end of May. It was such a joy to see our students walk across the stage in the graduation experience canopy while your loved ones cheered you on. Speaking of whom, if you're watching today's ceremony with a friend or family member, please pause for a moment, turn to them and say thank you. If you're physically apart from the ones you love, take a moment and send them a message to express your gratitude. Don't ever forget all the people who helped you get to this moment in your academic career. 
including the faculty and staff who shared their talent and wisdom with you. Now it is your responsibility to carry their teachings forward. On behalf of the entire DePaul community, congratulations. We can't wait to see what you do next. As you begin your next adventure, don't forget to stay connected to DePaul. Share your milestones with us. We would love to hear about them, and we know there will be many. Now at DePaul, graduation is all about our students. Throughout today's ceremony, we will be hearing from DePaul students, starting with the invocation. Our opening prayer not only reflects our Catholic and Vincentian values, but also mirrors how DePaul compassionately upholds the dignity of all members of its diverse, multi-faith, and inclusive community. Today, we are led in prayer by four students who have chosen to reflect on loss and hope. They bring their prayers from the Orthodox, Christian, Jewish, Muslim, and Roman Catholic traditions. We invite all who wish to join these students in prayer, knowing that while their specific words may not be universal, we hope their sense of acknowledging and calling in the divine speaks to many. For those who do not wish to join in prayer, we are thankful for your quiet reflection. Besmaam, Waweld, Woman Fesk Adus, Ahadu Amlak, Amen. I pray in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Lord, even in happy times such as our graduation, we come to you surrounded by sadness. Many of us have witnessed or experienced loss, social unrest, and deaths of innocent people in never-ending wars, including my homelands, Ethiopia and Yemen. We've experienced the disappointments of missing out on classroom banters, internship opportunities, celebration of life, and building relationships. May we never forget that life is unequivocally precious and should not be determined otherwise by those filled with racial aggressions towards our BIPOC communities. Lord, for however long our grief may last, remind us that we are not alone. Provide us comfort and ease our pain that we may carry with us. I pray for your blessing to see hope and progress towards our healing. Fill our hearts with everlasting strength and Vincentian spirit so we may handle whatever awaits us. As we strive towards healing, we find ourselves in times of uncertainty. We've waded through the waters of grief, and now, where do we go from here? We've finished our time at DePaul, and now many of us ask, now what? The world still feels as if it's on pause. And yet, in these times of unknowing, we strive for something new, looking into each day with fresh eyes. We say, Uvtuvo mechadesh bechol yom tamid ma'asev reshit. And in the goodness of Adonai, Adonai renews each and every day in the creation of the world. Each day, Adonai begins the world anew. As we face a new world ahead of us, we remember that as children of God, every day is an opportunity for a new beginning, for new adventures, and for new stories to be created. We trust Adonai to lead us into these new chapters of our lives. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Allahumma salli wa sallim wa barik ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi. Rabbana atina min ladunka rahmah wa hayyik lana min amrina rashada. Rabbana inna lima anzalta ilayna min khayrin fuqara. All praise and thanks are for Allah. Lord of the worlds, O oh Allah, send peace and blessings on Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam and on his family and followers. Our Lord, bless us with mercy from your own and provide us with guidance in our matters. Our Lord, we are in need 
of whatever good you send on us. Our Lord, forgive those who have returned to you. Grant healing and patience to us who still remain. Our Lord, what hope do we have besides you? If you don't give us a reason to have hope today, then no one else can. Indeed, you have power over all things. Heavenly Father, through the life, death, and resurrection of your Son, Jesus, you give us a new life and hope. Grant, we pray, O Lord, as our time at DePaul comes to a close, that we may be a people of faith. Send your Holy Spirit onto us as we enter the world, that we might be a light in the darkness. As members of the Vincentian family, help us to recognize you in one another, in the stranger, and in those on the margins of our world. Thank you for all the blessings you have given us. Open our hearts to your grace as we become beacons of your love in the years to come. We ask your presence among all gathered here as in jubilation we celebrate together. Amen. The most valuable thing I learned at Paul is definitely to work hard and to push yourself to do quality work all the time. Time management. I learned how to t manage my time. Before I was very, I did whatever I wanted, but I had to really be consistent and learn how to manage my time. Ask for help when you need it. Um, there's always someone out there willing to help you. You just have to ask. Keep going and like, and find the things that bring you joy as much as you can. Ooh, this kind of sounds weird, but empathy. So I feel like everyone thinks that they're empathetic, like just naturally, but to actually be empathetic and practice that, there's a big difference between sympathy and empathy and that is, it changes lives. <laughs> when my mom first came here with me, she was like, I really hope you go here. Like, <laughs> I really like it here. And that's like one of the things like Sarah and I first connected on when we were like freshmen is this like, the value in community of like caring for community. It's a very small cohort in each major and each year, which allows us to like really dig deep into those relationships. And I think that's what allowed me to like get through college <laughs> and stay. Because <laughs> there were these people that I spent all my time with that really became a pretty tremendous support system. Please welcome Lucy Baker, a member of the class of 2021 who will be performing the national anthem. Say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight O'er the ramparts we watched Were so gallantly streaming And the rocket red The bombs bursting in you know you made it. You made it to graduation day. You made it through the long nights, the midterms, the finals, that class or two that had you doubting your abilities, but you made it. I hope you know someone is proud of you. You should be proud of you. 
Graduating during times like these ain't no easy task. It's for the brave. I hope during your time at DePaul, you took St. Vincent's motto of what must be done to inspire you to take on leadership position. Lend a helping hand to your community or communities that might not look like yours on the surface, but are more alike to you than different. If you did not, I hope you know it's not too late. I hope you know what must be done is a constant question that must be asked beyond DePaul's walls. We've inherited a world that needs our help help to sustain itself, whether that means fighting the good fight against racism towards any marginalized group, fighting against ableism towards visible and invisible disabilities, fighting against xenophobia towards our brothers and sisters and non-binary family members across the globe, fighting against inequities rooted in sexism, transphobia and homophobia caused by fear when it should just be met with love and curiosity. I hope you know this is only the beginning of who you can be who you want to be. As a matter of fact, this is the beginning of who you must be. You don't need to be an expert at change. You just gotta wanna be an active participant. I hope you know you got this. We got this. You are fully equipped with everything you need to level up. So step forward, give yourself a hand, and repeat after me to new beginnings. Please welcome the Dean of the College of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences, Guillermo Vasquez de Velasco. Dear graduates, it is my pleasure to join you in celebration of this important moment in your lives. I hope you will always remember it, not only because of the unusual circumstances we are all experiencing, but mainly because of all what you have achieved during your tenure as a student at DePaul. I am sure that DePaul has been a place of learning for you. It has been a place of learning for me every single day as I continue to be enlightened by the amazing power of the liberal arts and social sciences. I hope you have also found it to be a place of empathy, a place of friendship, and a place of growth. Through your time at DePaul, and in particular at LAS, you have acquired the power to become perpetual learners, who not only understand the world around us, but are also actively engaged in the task of doing good and doing it well. With great power comes great responsibility. Yes, I'm a big fan of Spider-Man, but the statement is true. I am convinced that by working together, you will deliver us to a better tomorrow. Now, as you move into your next project in life, the Paul and the LAS family will always be here for you. Please stay in touch. And as I always like to say, may the liberal arts be always with you. Now, it is my pleasure to introduce your classmate and our student commencement speaker, Giselle Cervantes. Today, Giselle is earning her bachelor degree in international studies with a minor in music industry recording. Giselle is a first-generation college student and the proud daughter of immigrants from Mexico. At DePaul, Giselle has served in various leadership roles including our Student Government Association as the Executive Vice President for Diversity and Equity and as the President. She is a DePaul Community Service Association Coordinator and a Chicago Quarter Mentor, and finally, a Student Success Coach. Please join me in welcoming Giselle Cervantes. Esteemed faculty, staff, friends, family, and class of 2021. It is an honor to be standing in front of you today, even if it is virtually. I can only imagine the ways in which this year and this pandemic have been difficult for all of you. And I know that is an understatement, which is why I am grateful to be together with you all, although it may be different than what you envisioned. For my peers, you're probably quite used to being asked questions, being LAS majors. 
but I have one question that I hope will guide my address today. What does community care mean to you? I know that probably sounds like a weird question. You might be asking yourself, what does this question mean? Who is this girl? And why is she asking me questions on graduation day? I'm here today because I want you to reflect on how you have been cared for in your time at DePaul, or how you have shown care for others. This may have looked like sitting with the staff mentor and being treated with kindness and compassion. Care may look like the connection you built with your orientation leader or Chicago quarter mentor. It may look like receiving food from the Chartwell's workers who work diligently to provide food for our campus. It may look like the friendships you built in your student organizations. However you have experienced care, I want you to think of one example and sit with it. I can speak personally. I am a radically different person today than who I was when I first stepped foot on DePaul's campus. And this is for the better. You all have demonstrated what it means to stand in solidarity with one another. I have had the gift of experiencing genuine compassion from many of you, and the relationships I've built have formed me into a more authentic version of myself. In the midst of the pandemic, you organized and advocated for your fellow students, staff, and faculty. I saw people who are being honored in today's ceremony organize mutual aid funds, demonstrations, and exhibit what it truly means to care radically for one another. You have all reminded me that another world is possible. I have had the honor of a lifetime to be able to be in so many different spaces with members of this DePaul community. Through my involvement in the Student Government Association, the DePaul Community Service Association, the Service Immersion Program, and the Office of Student Involvement, I learned that every DePaul student is capable of advocating for a better world. You are all capable of advocating for a better world. I know this because I witnessed care being demonstrated without hesitation in these student organizations and in the classroom. In student government, I saw students spend countless hours weekly advocating for student issues. In the DePaul Community Service Association, I saw students engage in mutual relationships with people at community organizations around the city, redefining what service means. And in the classroom, I saw you all have necessary conversations about the injustices that face our campus and our world. This is what community care looks like. You might not know it, but as college graduates, you are all called to use the knowledge you have gained in your time at DePaul and use it to demonstrate your commitment to others. We all have an obligation to one another, to care for one another authentically and do everything we can to protect one another. We are obligated to care for each other because we need each other. Now, take the time to think about how you can empower others. What does that look like for you? How can you honor your whole self while also honoring the many gifts that other people bring? When we honor the human dignity of those around us, we are actively fighting for a more just world. Human dignity is a key element to the Vincentian mission of DePaul University. And it is evident through the love and compassion people at DePaul show one another. Gina Leal, a staff member in Mission and Ministry and a mentor of mine, once shared with me a quote by St. Vincent de Paul that says, love is inventive to infinity. Since love is inventive to infinity, I invite you all to think about how you might use love and compassion to motivate you as you depart this de Paul community. I know that you are all capable of taking steps that will lead us to a more just world. And I hope that you will take everything you have learned and only continue to expand and grow. We need each other to move forward. We are better when we take care of one another. We are better as a collective. Although we may be physically moving in different directions, I am a strong believer 
that once you are a blue demon, you are always a blue demon. We are bound together through our experiences, and for that, I am immensely grateful. Now, I leave you with one last call to action. Go out into the world and live out community care in action. I'm actually most proud about the journey. It's not the, you know, the end destination. I think it's just the journey. Sometimes you kind of forget what it took to get here. Holding a leadership role through my sorority as well, I got to serve as the vice president of risk management at my sorority. I was um, invited to be part of the college communications showcase, and I was able to show off one of the documentaries that I made. The accomplishment that I'm most proud of is being on a trial team my first year. Honestly, just getting into the ball. Just <laughs> That's been awesome, and then runner-up is going to be graduating. The thing that I'm most proud of for accomplishing here is that I'm the first one in my family to graduate. I'm thankful so much for my family. I would say the person I'm thankful for is my husband. Mostly my mom, because she has always been there for me, and she let me find my own path without him. Uh, influencing it in the right ways, but not forcing me to do anything I didn't want to do. My mom was my source of counsel, she was my source of comfort, and she was my source of pull it together, you need to do this. Thank you for my parents for, <laughs> definitely they wanted me to be like, like a nurse or a doctor. <laughs> but uh, I told them like I wanted to be in, in game development and they were really like supportive of me and I really appreciate that about them. I'm really thankful for my fellow RAs because they made my experience what it is. The people that I'm most thankful for is definitely my family and my older sister. I actually pushed me a lot. I want to especially give a shout out to my mom because she got her degree here at DePaul and she was a big reason why I wanted to go to DePaul. The Dean will now present the candidates for the conferral of degrees. On behalf of the faculty and staff of the College of Liberal Arts and Social Sciences, I respectfully present the candidates and recommend that the announced degree be conferred upon them. By the authority vested in me, by the Board of Trustees and the State of Illinois, I confer upon you the degree for which you have been recommended with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities appertaining thereunto. The following candidates have successfully completed the requirements and have been awarded their respective degrees. Marilyn Rubia Barca. Aya M. Abadalwahab. Sarah J. Abu Kaud. Jacqueline Abraham. Talitha Pianzola Abru. Beza Abuhado. Kyle Matthew Acevedo. Martel Adams. Michael Adato. Marquise Monet Atkins. Kaylin Q. Agarwal. Nick Aguilar. Asil Hossein Ahmed. Leroy Okoto. Aditya Alapati. Eric N. Aldieri. Brianna Page Abimbala Ale Baleye. Hawa Abdul Kafi El Sinosi Al Gatroni. Imran Ali. Isma Ali. Eshin Aliani. Khalid Abdullah M. Al Sharani. Esther Alva Bazan. Elizabeth Diana Alvarado. Lina Al Yasir, Hossein A. Amil, Alexander V. Anadiotis, Bryn Wallace Anderson, 
Jiraiye Rayshawn Anderson. Onyeka Deborah Anasigi. Melanie K. Anselmo. Karina Aragon. Kayla N. Arnett. Brockton Ash. Anna P. Asturias. Diana D. Atanasova. Kelsey Atkinson. Jessica Avery. Matthew Jeremiah Buckmeyer Flores. Maya Joy Baker. Michaela Balawag. Monica Bala. Janet Ballesteros. Patricia Joanna Banas. Ashley M. Bondis. Brenda Bond. Jan Barunchak. Landon Christopher Barber. Hannah Barlow. Lucas James Barnes. Dylan J. Barnick. Brennan G. Berry. Kevin Berry. Jasper Gobron Bauer. Aaron E. Baines. Nora Mary Beamish Lannan. Shellen T. Beasley. Christina Lynn Beck. Elizabeth Grace Becker. Brandon Robert Beter. Madeline Baer. Kira Natasha Bame. Jasper Ballou. Ava L. Bell. Crystal Bell. Will T. Benvenuto. Crystal E. Bergfield. Bennett R. Berman. Joseph E. Burmis Dawes. Jacob M. Bigos. Margaret Bjorklund. Deja B. Blackwell. Lillian Boachi. Grant W. Bodie. Tyler M. Bogarts Brown. Caitlin Marie Bolliard. Mia Borowski. Joseph Wyatt Borushek. Brooke Nicole Boyd. Chelsea B. Boyd. Sarah J. Bramer. Evan Breedlove. Brad S. Brewington. Brent A. Bridwell. Jason Brisson. Chloe Noel Brom. Adam M. Brown. Randy C. Brown. 
Wiley Wade Broon, Alexander Dylan Burke, Camille Burke, Trisha Marie Butera, Liam Carl Cahill Kurtz, Ariana Noel Calderon, Laura G. Campos, Abigail DeGuid Cano, Patrick Sean Cano, Christian Cardwell, Erin Elizabeth Kerrigan, Grace Ann Kerrigan, Ellen Carrillo, Gabriela D. Carrillo, Cameron Alexa Carter, Anna Cardi, Laura Nicole Carvajal, Madeline Castellanos, Cassandra Abigail Castillo, Natalie Castro, Diana M. Cazares, Sherry Lorraine Cedeno, Giselle M. Cervantes, Isabella Chapman, Morgan Charles Chase, Jose D. Chavez, Sarah Cherry, Julia E. Chacha, Athena Lauren Clark, Hunter Clark, Michaela Coleman, Laura Vanessa Colores, Arnez Audrell Cooper, Kyle J. Cooper, Hugo Vicente Coronado Mena, Yureli Cortez, Madeline F. Cortapassi, Sandra Lorena Cosio, Joseph Coughlin, Eva G. Cowan, Lennox Cowan, William Martin Nee Cox, Caitlin Ashley Crawford, Abby L. Creek, Jeffrey Barry Cronin, Jana Helam Cruz, Isabel M. Cueto, Michael J. Cullen, Michael J. Cunha, Haley Isaac Curtis, Aaron Rose Cusack, Melina Guadalupe Dane Dodson, Christina M. Danielson, Isabella G. Datillo, Eduardo Davila, Jakara Grace Davis, Patricia Rose Davis, Stephen Davis, Andrew Edwin Dawson, Emily C. De Leon, 
Grant Tyler Deal, Kelsey C. Dean, Madera De Freitas, Samantha C. Del Toro, Leva C. Delabar, Sokol Delisi, Charles James Derisque, Helena Rose Devons Ortlieb, Sophia Alexandra Diamantacos, Franco Orly Diaz, Magali Diaz, Rio Diaz, Magali Samantha Diaz Gasca, John Robert Dietrich, Laneshia K. Dixon, Elizabeth C. Dories, Benjamin W. Dajutrek, Madison Ann Dorn, Robert Dotson, Mariko M. Dowling, Amanda M. Drexler, Haley Joy Drugas, Perry Ellen Drury, Alana Doolin, Mandolin Dunn, Madeline Haught Easton, Sahel Ebrahimi, Samuel James Eckert, Emily Rose Einhorn, Sarah Elizabeth Elam, Patrick J. Elliott, Delia Elizabeth Eppel, Jade Erickson Russo, Avery Michelle Evans Allen, Joanna S. Awida, Cynthia Fabian, Albert Louis Falcone, Olivia Madison Falcone, Taylor Falls, Tim Joseph Farrell, John Ferris, Madison A. Fast, Viviana Favela, Kathleen M. Fenton, Natalia Isabel Fernandez, Eileen Fay, Rosanna Fiashi, Kelly Rachel Flanagan, Brianna M. Flores, Daphne Viridiana Flores, Colleen Brianna Fogarty, Sarah Michelle Frankowitz, Jessica L. Freeman, Felicia Freitag, Daniel Haig Friedland, Brandon Peter Friedman, Rada Friedman, Alice Meng Meng Fu, Ashley Gaffigan, Caitlin Gallagher, 
Rose and Liberta Gallo. Annette Galvez. David Garcia. Elise A. Gardunio. Griselda Garibay. Erica Garza. Christopher D. Gates. Carson Marie Gengler. Raquel Gugassian. Lorraine T. Gibson. Lydia G. Geyer. Paige Michelle Gilberg. Lauren Ginn. Gabrielle M. Glossigal. Emma Saylor Goldberg. Nico Gomez. Jesse Alex Gonzalez. Desire Gonzalez. Sharon Rachel Goodman. Mia Isabella Goular. Florentine Gratisnig. Caitlin M. Grady. Shahrazad Arian Grays. Liam Ellis Greenfield. Olivia Lee Griffin. Amelia Lenise Griggs. Ashley Denise Griggs. Lauren Grimaldi. Samuel M. Grobart. Michael Garica. Colin Nicholas Guido. Stephen Guzman. Dylan Seth Haber. Haley R. Halcom. Brianna Hale. Francesca Paniota Helikius. Charles James Hallman. Kathleen Hamilton. Natalie Lynn Hammonds. Michael Sang Wu Han. Sarah Han Burke. Patricia Christine Haney. Dylan James Harsberger. Sean Michael Harper. Naomi May Harvey Turner. Noor Hassan Hassan. Nahal Hashemian. Ikra Hashwani. Nora Haskell. Tori Hatton. Roxanne Haveman. Lucas Jeffrey Holly. Sumaya Haidar. Somaya J. Hames. Ethan E. Hike. Michael Helen. Casey Lynn Henderson. Brittany Siach Henry. Alessa Hepker. Ariana G. Hernandez. 
Jennifer Grace Hernandez, Maritza Herrera, Wyatt James Heddle, Gustavo Hidalgo, Samantha C. Hillsman, Mitchell D. Hurst, William Joseph Hochbrin, Kaylin Josephine Hochlutner, Ryan Ray Holland, Alessandrina Corinne Holiday. Laura Hool, Hannah K. Hopkins, Julia Marie Horn, Taylor Howard, Caitlin Margaret Howland, Erna Erstick. Qian Huang, Alexis M. Huante, Aaron Mary Hughes, Patrick James Hurley, Danielle Hussey, Jade Huyn Pring. Hannah Elise Hyman. Alyssa D. Isberto. Dua Israr. Kayla Ivanyuk. Alexis A. Jackson. Jamila Jackson. Zoe Delia Jackson. Tony Thomas Jacob. Scott Jock. Hamashi Janviev Jaya Sundara. Joseph Stefan Jaswinski. Amani Jerome. Saul A. Jimenez. Bradley K. Johnson. Elizabeth Johnson. Infinity Jones. Alexis N. Joyce. Cousel Julie. Miki Karen Kainuma. Nazar Kumar. Nicholas John Cannon. Loyala Conwall. Samir Kapteli. Aisha Kareem. Christina Kasapi. William Jacob Katoskas. Danica M. Katovich. Emily A. Katzman. Cheyenne Jane Kazaraz. Cecilia A. Carney. Colin Quinn Carney. Jessica Keedy. Kristen Keller. Chris Michael Kemming. Brian Doyle Kennedy. Hayes English Kennedy. Dylan Patrick Kennelly. Kara M. Kirpin. 
Nora M. Kafarkas. Sarah Abigail Kingsley. Andrew L. Klensman. Riley Knox. Anastasia Grace Coys. Laura Elizabeth Kohler. Roxana Kolber. Veronica Kalita. Charles David Colums. Anais Kunde. Chloe Ellen Korn. Rachel Sidney Cosmos. Rachel Grace Crackett. Andrew A. Krause. Harlan Ralph Kerr. Stephanie Coe. Judy Kariha. Joanna Kurnat. Marina Alexis Kyriakopoulos. Francesca LaRocca. Elizabeth R. LaChapelle. Jennifer Lynn Lauer. Michaela Lynn Lawson. Madeline Elizabeth Leary. Jacqueline Lennon. Matthew J. LeMay. Carly Grace Leonard. Nathaniel Allen Lenhart. Jasmine Lerma. Seth Lerner. Noah L. Levinson. Jasmine Aileen Lewis. Declan Flaherty Lighthouse. Connor David Limbaugh. Endisha Taylor Logan. Kunal Lohana. Shayna Lombardo. Brian Matthew Lopez. Eva Lopez Benetti. Amanda C. Lowe. Mateo Lewison. Ashley Lydon. Danielle Nicole Mabry. John McEachin. Jessica Elizabeth Mack. Agnes McTavish. Luis Madrigal. Jonathan Mahaffey. Zenon Mahalbisic. Peter Maiolo. Alana Malinchuk. Aisha Mullick. Zora A. Mullick. Elise N. Mullen. Kayla Hunt Malinowski. Patricia Mary Maloney. Parker Mancino. Sarah P. Manos. Cecilia Marchant. Montserrat Marchant. 
Karen Marin Manzo. Marie Nicole Marks. Ana Rosa Marquez. Dulce Rosario Martinez. Jacqueline Martinez. Julian Martinez. Karina Morea Martinez. Tessa M. Martinez. Valeria Martinez. Allison Mateusian. Francesca Matthews. Akiva M. Mattinson. Marcus Matty. Robert Francis Maxwell. Emily Rebecca May. Martin Timothy McCahill. Lawrence Clifton McCollum. Ashley F. McCord. Dorothy J. McCullough. Eilish McDonough Hermer. Anthony McElrath. William McFarland. Mary L. McKenna. Ian M. McKitterick. Riley Jane McLaughlin. Maureen McLellan. Mary Josephine McManaman. Aaron Kathleen McMillan. Jamal McPherson. Elena G. Medeiros. Brittany Medina. Geverly Yodesmi Mendez. Megan Mendoza. Guan Yao Meng. Nicole L. Merced. Robert C. Merkel. Marissa M. Merlino. Stefan Masarovich. Juliet Elizabeth Meltivier. Lydia stays in Michael. Timothy Alban Mahalik. Regina Renee Midget. Aniello Mealy. John Walters Millis. Dana Jean Leanne Miller. Takahana Bagley Miller. Bridget Mitchell. Chance M. Mitchell. Aaron Mitchell. Kyle Branded Mitchell Abel. Amelia F. Modes. Megan Jean Melinda. Haley Aaron Moles. William Thomas Monahan. Ariana Brene Moore. Anna Morales. Ephthemia Maria Mores. Gotta Mary Moore. Megan Ryan Morris. 
Delaney F. Morrison, Jillian E. Morrison, Camilla Morochkovsky, Jetta Mulai, Gabriella Ann Mulder, Madison L. Mullins, Michelle K. Munoz, Nellie Murphy, Gabriel S. Napolitano, Afrin Cameron Nariman, Sasha B. Nareen, Daisy Navaretti, Madison Ann Neal, Emily Neary, Cole Ribic Nieder, Kelly Neenan, Catherine S. Nelson, Tristan B. Nelson, Ryan Sidney Namadi, Phoebe Elizabeth Tyler Neerum, Tori Main Netzer, Tom Nguyen, Jenna Nichols, Nicole Gina Nitti. Destiny Gabrielle Nobles. Raina Ashley Nomura. Madeline Rose Norgard. Rebecca Ann Novak. Stephanie L. Nunez. Portia Chinwe Wokuku. Jenna O'Connor. Delia M. Oda. Nathan Odenkirk. Mackenzie Mariah Odman. Zachary Esterreicher. Anthony Chike Okocha. Jessica Oleznik, Danielle Ortiz, Sophia Nicole Ospital, Yasmin Outlaw, Monique S. Ovali, Mary Owen. Marissa Owens. Marika E. Owens. Allison Pace. Jessica Ariel Pagan. Valeria Pagan. Caitlin Elizabeth Pagankopf. Sophia Milano Papas, Elizabeth Paredes, Maya Parwick, Danielle Kang Park, Mariana Para, Morgan Gabrielle Parton. Josue Ivan Pasillas. Srina Alpesh Patel. Fioriana Maria Payton. Tiffany Tiana Payton. Patrick Lewis Pedersen. Nasco Palinka. 
Sylvia Pino. Ana Perez. Katharina N. Pergamon Seva. Elizabeth Ann Peterman. Tiana Catherine Petrisevich. Megan Elizabeth Fursdorf. Justin Fu. Sarah Elizabeth Pinsky. Jessica Placencia. Catherine Quinn Palucha. Kristen K. Portland. Guxel Puser. Georgina S. Quintana. Rosanna Mariana Quixito. Zane Alavdeen Kuzer. Anna Patricia Ramos. Bradley B. Ramos. Elena Ramsey. Elena Saren Ranga. Mark J. Rayski. Hannah S. Reed. Benjamin Paul Reef. Mary Jane Reinhardt. Megan Elizabeth Renner. Aranza I. Reyes. Michael Brad Reynolds. Hannah Rhodes. Jenna Margaret Riatti. Leslie S. Rice. Heather M. Richmond. Elizabeth Ann Riley. Julia L. Rivero. Hannah Marie Robin. Arlita Josephine Robinson. Aiden Christine Rodriguez. Jacqueline A. Rodriguez. Kira Hilal Rodriguez Jackson. Manuela Ayana Rodriguez Dantzler. Emma V. Rose. Rebecca Rogers. Kenya Roman. Alondra Romero. Fabiola Romero. Rachel M. Romero. Stephanie Cheyenne Roney. Briar Rose Alexis Rude. Candace Rose. Anna Helene Roth. Courtney R. Rowe. Hope Roosevelt. Elizabeth Rose Ruda. Rachel D. Rudolph. Tierra Russell. Rima Rustum. Zoe Aurora Rutherford. Mary C. Ryan. Teresa Kathleen Ryan. Jade E. Ryerson. Makleet Sake. Amalia V. Salmeron. 
Estefanie Sanabria, Diane Sanchez, Kimberly Kanani Sanderson, Austin David Sandifer, Omar Sandoval, Joseph Anthony Santoro, Emily Juan Cottingham Sara, James Galzitti, Connor George Scarlatis, Linda Ray Scherzinger, Kyle Steven Schuring, Naomi J. Shipkovitz, Mindy Love Schmidt, Anna Schutz, Anna M. Skoltoff, Miriam Virginia Searcy, Annalisa Sedlicek, Dean Hassan Safarovich, Benjamin Rob Siegel, Cassandra Lynn Selzer, Shayak Shataraj Sengupta, Christine Sergelin, Andrea Serna, Ruby Serrano, Lizbeth Servan, Natalia A. Cesare, Maya Sinclair Shackelford, Sarah Shaheen, Huda Mariam Sharif, Eileen E. Shea, Emily Davis Shuris, Darielle Dominique Sherrod, Musa Siam, Aiden Siegel, Grace C. Siegelman, Riley K. Signor. Yesenia Silva, Liamie Simbakalia, Sarah Sims, Lily Simon, Catherine Grant Sims, Victoria Elay Slaughter Harris. Brock Donovan Slider, Brian Smith, Jackson Emmanuel Smith, Ryan Michael Smith, Sydney Gluck Smith, Alyssa Brooke Snavely. Dana Soder, Kuldeep Singh D. Solanke, Dhruvi Sanjay Soni, Ashley Sorensen, Marvin Soto Perez, Rose Spence. Taylor Spees, Abigail Springer, Walter Scott Stallings, Alexandra A. Stomatis, Adriana Maria Stanovich, Victoria Soroshtik. 
Peter George Stellis, Emma Rose Stevens, Kevin Richard Stock, Hope M. Stotzel, Sarah Grace Stolpe, John M. Stukenberg, Margaret Carlin Sullivan, Sonia Sultan, Cameron James Swanson, Anya Rebecca Shentis, Sarah E. Simkoviak, Jawan Talabani, Tyree Taylor, Blaine Tepema, Cristal Terrazas, Allison E. Terry, Quinn Clara Tessman, Ava Tews, Huey W. Tay, Chloe M. Theus, Claire C. Thol, Kenneth Bernard Thomas. Lindsay Wilson Tillman, Cassidy Timmons, Aaron K. Tennant, Kevin John Tatsudlowski, Matthew B. Talbert, Juan Miguel Torres. Santa C. Torrijo, Lydia Tortolero, William Alexander Treat, Claire Trinkle, Stefania Triolo, Mary Chase Sui. Morgan E. Turner, Joanna Rochelle Tuthill, Margaret M. Tyler, Emerald Udoka, Vanessa Umatoni, Adriana Underwood. Berker Astura, Rachel Uwase, Abby Emily Vakulskis, Angel C. Valdez, Cameron Van Hare, Derek Lane Van Thullenar. Kate Marie Vasquez Braun, Alan Weisman, Nathan Velarde, Veronica Y. Velasco, Anishwa Ram Vivekananthan, Taylor Volk. Rije Wade, Priya Kale Wade, Ariel A. Walker, Kirsten Walker, Kelly Wallace, Trinity Wan. Jang Wen Wong, Ki Rue Wong, 
Shahim K. Ward, Ian S. Ware, Farron N. Washington, Amy Marisa Wasowitz, Grace Lauren Weber, Nathan T. Weimerskirk, Emily Welch, Dion West, Ashley M. Wetham, Jacob Mark Whitford, Madeline Jo Wilcox, Susan McNally Wild, Ariel Williams, Dejan DeAndre Williams, Haley Christine Williams, Najari Williams, LaRonda Wilson, Nina Rose Wilson, Meyer Freerit Winsberg, Kareen Inez Witt, Victoria Voitu, Rachel Marciano Wynicki, Jackson R. Wolf. Destiny Woods. Rebecca Rose Woods. Jordan Matthew Wright. Megan Georgina Wright. Christina Wisnitsky. Victoria I. Yakubchik. Abigail Ahmed Yimer. Romana Yunin. Fallon Alicia Young. Sandra Young. Yasmin Yusuf. Christina M. Zeski. Victoria I. Zicina. Robert Zimmer. Rebecca Marie Zoltan. Mary A. Zopp. Kate E. Zucker. Natalia A. Zukowski. Rodolfo Tomas Zuleta. I feel accomplished. I feel very proud. When I was a freshman, I was nervous, but excited for all opportunities. Nepal has connected me to some amazing mentors, professional opportunities, and some of my closest friends. This pandemic has helped me have a clearer direction of what I want to do with my career. The Ascension mission has really taught me that when I see injustice, I have to say something and I have to do something. After I graduate, I hope to pursue a career that makes me happy and just live a life that I'm super proud of. And it's just really up to me to determine what it is that I really want to do because I know I'm built to succeed.
Please welcome the president of DePaul University, Dr. Gabriel Esteban. Members of the Vincentian community and the clergy, trustees, life trustees, faculty, administration, staff, and honored guests. I'm Gabriel Esteban, president of DePaul University. Thank you for joining us today to celebrate the DePaul University class of 2021. Your presence means everything to us. I also would like to recognize any members of the military and veterans who are watching today's ceremony. Thank you for your service. I know this year has not been easy, especially for our graduating students. It's important to acknowledge that living through a global pandemic is a defining experience. You're different because of it. You're more flexible and patient. You're stronger. You likely have a new perspective on life. I'm inspired by your tenacity, drive, and kindness. The class of 2021 has demonstrated throughout this time. I'm also extremely grateful to all the faculty and staff who have supported our students throughout this past year. You went above and beyond to make sure our students succeeded and completed their education at DePaul. Today is a victory for you as well. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. At DePaul, we strive to be an inclusive and diverse community of learners who work for change. We work together to transform society. The world has a lot of uncertainties right now, but hope is on the horizon. We can feel the real potential for individual, institutional, and societal change. That's why now, more than ever, the world needs DePaul graduates. There are more than 6,000 students in the class of 2021, and the world needs every single one of you. We need entrepreneurs, economists, and hospitality leaders, journalists, filmmakers, computer scientists, and game designers teachers, counselors, writers, artists, diplomats, and historians, nurses, psychologists, scientists, and mathematicians, musicians, and actors. The world needs DePaul graduates because you know what it takes to succeed. You know how to roll up your sleeves and do whatever it takes to get the job done. You understand the importance of giving back. You have the courage to ask, what must be done? At DePaul, our Catholic Vincentian mission to serve the public good is at the heart of everything we do. We have taught you to fight for social justice, help those most in need, listen, and be kind. Please keep our Vincentian values close to your heart. Be mindful of the responsibility that comes with a DePaul diploma, the diploma that bears the name of St. Vincent de Paul. DePaul University, class of 2021, you are ready to serve a changing world. Transformed by your DePaul education, grounded in mission. Make us proud. The last step in your journey at DePaul is to be inducted into the alumni community. It is my distinct honor to introduce our special alumni guest, four-time Emmy Award winner Lourdes Duarte. Lourdes earned her Bachelor of Arts degree in communication from DePaul University. She co-anchors the WGN Evening News and is one of the station's top 
investigative reporters. DePaul has always been proud to call Lourdes one of our own. We're very grateful she could join us today to celebrate the class of 2021. Please join me in welcoming Lourdes Duarte. Well, not long ago, I was in the same place you find yourself in right now. Only I didn't face the obstacles you've all overcome, a pandemic, historic unrest, and an entire world undergoing economic and social challenges that have changed the way we think, the way we operate, and the way we move forward. Let me ease some of your concerns. The fact that you have managed all of this and are still pushing through and ready for the wonderful journey that comes after today means that you are ready. And I couldn't be prouder to stand here with you today. I'm a DePaul graduate and hold that as a badge of honor. Today, you share that badge with me and so many others who will always, always be rooting for you. In my eyes, DePaul graduates are Chicago's very own. So inscribed upon this scroll are the names of the members of DePaul University's 122nd graduating class, the class of 2021. We accept these graduates into the DePaul University Alumni Association. Members of the 122nd graduating class, we, the DePaul community of over 195,000 alumni living in all 50 states and around the world, Welcome you to the next step in your lifelong connection with DePaul as students yesterday, graduates today, and alumni forever. The continued vitality of DePaul University depends upon each of us as alumni and our pledge of commitment and service to the university. We now invite you, the class of 2021, to move your tassel from the right to the left, a symbolic gesture of your transformation from a student of DePaul University to a lifelong learner and citizen of the world. So you do it with me right here. Let's find the tassel. Graduates, go ahead and turn your tassel. And here we go. There you have it. Congratulations, class of 2021. Congratulations, class of 2021. You've done it. Congratulations, class of 2021. Well, you did it. You've graduated. Congratulations. And we could not be more proud of you. Your education has certainly been a transformative experience. Believe me when I say it makes you stronger and wiser in the long run. I want to take this opportunity to congratulate you and commend you for taking on the challenge and completing the challenge. It is amazing what you have accomplished and the means through which you have accomplished it. And all props to you for sticking it out. It has been such a great honor to be your teacher and thank you for all that you have taught me over the years. We are hoping that you will go out into the world and that you will brighten the quarter that you're in. That wherever you are, you will live a life of purpose. Be well, do good work, do great work and keep in touch. I leave you with a quote from my favorite story, A Little Prince. One sees clearly only with the heart. Best wishes and congratulations, class of 2021. Go do great things. Congratulations, class of 2021. We are so proud of everything that you have accomplished. Congratulations, class of 2021. Keep shaking it up. We're all so proud of you. Congratulations, class of 2021. I love you, I love you, I love you. Mm, mm, mm. And I will look forward to hearing about all of your tremendous accomplishments. most important things I've learned from DePaul is that you are born to make a difference. This year, when we hear the word graduation, I think for many it's bittersweet. We're happy to be moving forward and in thinking about all of our experiences we shared at DePaul. DePaul has changed my life for the better. I've been on the Dean's List ever since I got here, and I cannot express the amount of gratitude I have for this university. 
The one person I'm most grateful for during my time at DePaul has been my family. So I guess it's more than one person. Thank you, DePaul. Thank you, DePaul. Thank you, DePaul Athletics. Thank you to my family. Go Blue Demons. Go Blue Demons. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'd like to thank both my kids for all their support while I studied. I want to thank everyone that I've had the opportunity to work with, all the professors and staff. Thank you, guys.